All right. Steve Spangler back from the Ellen Show, number 19. Crazy. Crazy. Number 19. That How was kind of fun. Yeah, going to run at 3 very, o'clock very this afternoon. Absolutely right. And uh, it's it's funny. What a classy woman. Uh, she As soon as the announcement came out with our new show called DIY Sci, she and her producers were the first back in January to say, come on the show. We would love to make the announcement oh, for nice. you. Nice. And so that's exactly yes. what she, we did. And so that's why we're doing some small things like this. Okay. And then we did that huge thing, like that big card explosion. What was that, that was can crazy. I show you? you had a dream, you said. I had a dream that you were doing an experiment with balloons on the back of a truck. <laughs> well, you're not in the back of a truck, but this is how it goes. But it is right, the balloons. So put your glasses on. Put okay, your glasses on. we need safety mm -hmm. first, uh, right? A, uh, a balloon's worst enemy is what? Uh, a little kid. A sharp object. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. That was close enough. Really, really, really glad. Same really, thing. really good. Hang on there. Watch what happens when the when the things get close. Oh, See how it pops? Oh, yes. That's because I didn't go into the right place. Okay. When you have a balloon here, hang on there, Sparky. <laughs> <laughs> I thought those were rubber, rubber gloves. No, no, no. These are, uh, I want to clear balloons because I want to see, see where the skewer is going. So a balloon, if you look at the anatomy of a balloon or the science of a balloon, there's a part where the stress is the greatest amount. And these molecules, uh, okay. these latex molecules, are stretched the most. And it's right here in the very middle. That's why it's the clearest. Mm -hmm. Here at the very end, if you can see, it's a little bit uh, pulled together. And this is pulled together as well. Okay. So if you took a sharp object, there's a possibility you could actually pierce the balloon. You so watch. So? Oh, my Start goodness. into the nervous. bottom little area there and just push so try it okay, just, just push right here yep oh there it is push oh, keep going you can do it Toronto go harder and push oh. there it is now keep oh going oh keep going oh. keep going oh you did it good job now you have to have an exit strategy I that's all so well. the very top go push just keep oh on goodness. going you're it's gonna do gonna great pop. you're Are gonna you do sure? great yes keep going keep going I'm gonna help you I'm gonna help you oh there it is <laughs> now isn't this a nice way to be able to say I can go through a volatile situation as long as I have an entry point and an exit point Everything like everywhere. The desk is moving. But who would have ever thought that you could do this? We did it with a giant balloon on the show. But it's these simple kinds of mm. things when we're looking about the science uh, and the anatomy of a balloon. It might so shrink you can a little put, bit. I, right? oh, it's it's okay. It's not a problem <laughs> that is at all. So cool. But if you understand the chemistry of it and you understand uh, that, I think it's a nice metaphor to say I can go into any volatile situation. I just have to understand the entry point. I got to go where there's a yeah. least amount of stress. And don't counselors do that well with kids? Come and now I have to have an exit amount. strategy. Our politics Politicians have to understand that too. We need an exit <laughs> strategy. I don't think they understand it's that. A life and lesson. you can go through wow. a really volatile situation if you just understand. Out. There it is. There. That? Bam. Oh, it's there. and then you Who go knew? to that pressure know, Of course point you again. do. This hey, is uh, great. a sharp, a sharp uh, cooking skewer. I put a little bit of Vaseline on the cooking skewer as well, mm -hmm. just to make it so it. it goes and you have some nice sandpaper to make it. Sand yes, yeah, so yeah. I did it that way. So of course it's always uh, great to wear your safety glasses and to do it. But tune in today at three o'clock for the Ellen Show here at Nine News, and I'll show you a whole bunch of things. All right. Kind of fun. You've always been a science. Things. How about that? Steve, thank, thank you much. Thank you much.